Given talk of Intel focusing more on its core business, the end of Optane and HEDT seemingly dying, is there any concern that Intel might pull the pin on GPUs given the time it took to release, uh, the poor performance, driver issues, and likely very low sales? There's certainly been rumors that uh, mm. Intel's executive is uh, at least considering or don't know don't know whether considering is the right word, but they're considering the possibility of uh, dropping the GPU line, the discrete GPU line. But again, it's not really a confirmed report or anything, so who knows what's going to happen there. But you know, I think from our perspective, we've talked about this before, that Intel, if you're making a discrete GPU series, you have to be in it for the long run. Like mm. it's not something you should be releasing one generation, realizing, oh, that was hard. Lots of challenges there. We're yeah. going to have to fix our drivers and performance isn't where we want. And then you suddenly go, no, nah, we're just going to cut it from there. Like why why bother doing all that work Surely. if you're going to cut it after the first generation? It was always going to take two, three, maybe even four generations to be properly competitive. So yeah. when Intel decided to make discrete GPUs, they should have been 100% committed to knowing this, to know that first generation is going to be pretty underwhelming, second generation we might improve a little bit, and then hopefully by third and fourth gen, our products are in a really good space if they keep executing well. Mm -hmm. So I think it would be pretty silly for them to just cut the, the series right now. But then silly. again, whether that, that doesn't mean they won't do it. Yep. They, they very much might do that because it has probably, I would say probably, fallen below where they expected internally. I think they probably were expecting it to at least be more widely available than it is right now, mm. especially since isn't isn't th supposedly we have to all wonder, the cars are ready to go. You have to wonder with these companies and how they're structured, like how much fibbing goes on with what they project. Yeah, yeah. Because you can't sure. you can't be like, all right, we want to do GPUs, we've got a, a team dedicated to it, we want to pull it off, but it's gonna cost billions of dollars. It's definitely gonna suck. Investors are gonna hate it. You're going to see no return on in profit. But think of the big picture. In 10 years, we can make money off this. Companies hate that, especially public. They're definitely companies. not pitching it that way. They're like, oh, we'll hit the ground running. You know, we've we've got a team of talented guys. We can... Yeah, for this, sure. This stuff that's taken AMD and NVIDIA decades to iron out, we'll do that because we're Intel. We'll nail that. And I'm sure that's more how it went, which is... And then when it doesn't go that way, that's where talks of like, oh, uh, we were sort of misled on how this was going to be executed. Now, do we want to pull the pin on it? I'd have, you know, not that I, not that I'm an yeah. expert on how these business things go, but I, I wouldn't be shocked if that was um, too far off the truth. No, that does sound sound right. But hopefully, mm. there's some cool, calm, collected heads at Intel that are resetting those expectations to where yeah. they should have been, mm -hmm. which is that this first generation was never gonna, yeah, unless they were wild, wildly overperforming. Yeah. It's like codename barely getting the foot in the door. Yep. Like, I mean, how how could Intel look at AMD struggling to gain market share over how many years having this discrete GPU program and be like, yeah, so Intel, so AMD's taken like 10, 15 years and they're at 20% market share, whatever they're at, but we'll, we'll do it in one generation. Mm. <laughs> it's just completely mm -hmm. mismatched expectations. But again, we'll see what they decide to do on that one. Hopefully they keep it on board. Mm.